Hello and welcome to Daily Dose Radio, a five-minute a day podcast studying the Psalms verse by verse, recorded here in the dining room of the Bible Bistro, located in Sharonville, Ohio. Hey there, friend. Welcome back to Daily Dose Radio here in the Bible Bistro. Today we're going to look in all this week at Psalm 94. Psalm 94 is 23 verses long, so we're going to tackle the entire psalm this week. This psalm comes to us uh, without a title, so there's no title or introduction in the Masoretic text. Uh, there is a title, however, in the in the Septuagint and in some other texts, the Syriac, the Ethiopic, the, those have a title, and they all say of David. So this is a title, uh, the title or the introduction says of David. The one I have here says of David for the fourth Sabbath of God. Don't really does the title's not telling or the introduction's really not telling us anything except that it's of David. And as you look through here, this sounds a lot like David too. We'll, we'll get through some of these things that really kind of point up a Davidic hand, I think, perhaps, that we have here. Um, we're going to do verses 1 through 4 today, and then tomorrow we're going to take a big bite. We're going to uh, read 5 through 11. But I think we need to read that one together because that sort of stands. It's an important piece, and we need to, we need to look at that. So let me read for us 1, 2, 3, and 4. O Lord God, to whom vengeance belongeth, O God, to whom vengeance belongeth, show thyself. Lift up thyself, thou judge of the earth. Render a reward to the proud. Lord, how long shall the wicked, how long shall the wicked triumph? How long shall they utter and speak hard things, and all the workers of iniquity boast themselves? Well, we have a lot right here, don't we, just in these four verses. We see right away that there's a cry to God to come and judge, to lift himself up and judge the earth. O thou judge of the earth, rather, render a reward to the proud. So we're talking about the proud, then the wicked are mentioned in verse 3, and then the workers of iniquity there in verse 4. So again, we have this combination of descriptive language about you know someone who is troubling the people of God. And so the, the prayer is, show yourself. You know, these people, uh, they're, they're doing some bad stuff. Come and show yourself. You that judge the earth, render a reward. So judgment is being asked for. Not, not really vengeance, because vengeance depends on an emotional response. It's ginned up by the energy of anger. And God is not motivated in the same way. So when, when we see the word vengeance here, think that, you know, really what the psalmist is asking God to do is to come and judge. Judge between right and wrong. And he lays out right and wrong for us here. But notice his language in 3 and 4. He says, Lord, how long shall the wicked, how long shall the wicked triumph? That question is so familiar to us. And as a matter of fact, this is going to be the last time that we see the how long question in the Psalms. This, in this 94th Psalm, this is the end of them. We've seen the how long question in Psalm 6, 13, 35, 74, 79, 80, 89, and 90, and now here in 94, we have it again. How long? How long shall the wicked triumph? How long shall they utter hard speeches, utter and speak hard things? And the workers of iniquity boast themselves. So remember, he, he said, render a reward to the proud, and now you see the workers of iniquity are boasting. Well, what it is that they're boasting about, we'll find out tomorrow, and it's not good. But we've set up for ourselves, and the, well, the psalmist has, set up for us the occasion of this prayer. Something has happened. The wicked are attacking the people of God. They're just attacking decent life. And the prayer now is, rise up and come and render judgment against these that are doing wrong. Tomorrow we'll find out what some of that wrong stuff is. So I hope you'll join me then here on Daily Dose Radio. Thanks for listening to Daily Dose Radio. For more fresh and delicious Bible studies, podcasts, books, and more, check out the Bible Bistro online and on YouTube. Join me again next time for Daily Dose Radio.